Um, OK, I'm going to introduce to you today an airport's case study. Um, first of all, Lamore. Um, we are a consultancy service providing very closely aligned goals to the Global Goals Initiative from the United Nations. Uh, so we're focused on driving innovation, sustainability and partnerships to create that better future. And we do this by collaborating and creating that effective and continuous improvement for organisations. The platform today I'm going to talk to you about is Twinzo, uh, and Twinzo is a uh, incredibly diverse platform. Uh, the example and the case study we'll do today is an airport, but examples and alternatives um, are only limited to your imagination. So applications in manufacturing, automotive and so on and so forth are, uh, are there. And it's a completely agnostic digital twin ecosystem uh, designed to allow sensors, technology, data sources, and, and points of information to seamlessly uh, interface and interact. It's available on uh, the App Store kind of uh, model, so it's a subscription basis, so you create your digital twin and then add on features and functionality. And it already seamlessly works on Windows, iOS and Android platforms, so the aim being that uh, it can be accessible and in the pocket of every member of the staff or every member of the uh, customer network. Organisations that already use the infrastructure include the likes of Whirlpool, Skoda, Stellantis and many more. Um, and uh, what I'll do now is just give you a bit of a video on this. Welcome to the Digital Twin Solution for Aviation and Airport Managers. In this video, we'll take a look at how the airport's digital twin works, its functionalities and how it can benefit organisations in different ways. The results of previous installations of the Twinzo solution have been impressive. Facility managers have reported significant returns on investment, with the digital twin providing valuable data and insights to optimize their operations. Their digital twins have led to reduction in operational costs and improved efficiencies. The size and type of digital twin installation can vary depending on needs, with the digital twin solution able to scale to fit any facility size and complexity. The airport digital twin is a virtual representation of a complete airport operation, from car parking, concessions and terminal operations to airside ops, fueling and infrastructure. It offers a wide range of insights, intelligence and benefits to managers and operational teams in real time. Based on previous installations, the digital twin has provided a high return on investment, reduced logistics fleet and is adaptable to different installation sizes. The digital twin is built for easy and intuitive user interaction via the Twinzo app, accessible on Apple iOS, Android and Microsoft operating systems. With the airport digital twin, you can follow the movement of an aircraft as it arrives, taxes and departs. Data can include real-time information such as a number of passengers on board, flight delays, origin and destination, cargo loads and much more. The airport's digital twin provides a range of functionalities that cover the whole airport facility. You can easily navigate through different types of connected infrastructure, defined areas and buildings, and view the status of each smart building sensor or data feed. The digital twin can show you the location of tracked cargo going to or coming from an aircraft and provide heat map and logistics movement data from a connected smart warehouse. The data is transferred in real time via an API, which enables seamless integration with other airport systems. Security is a top priority for the digital twin solution, and the infrastructure is designed to protect data against cyber threats and unauthorized access. This ensures that organizations and security managers. Sorry, I think we've lost the uh, the video feed there. We can just see your desktop now, Andy, nothing else. Sorry, let me just re reboot. Welcome to the digital twin solution for aviation and airport managers in real time. This solution supports easy import and export of data between Excel and Twinzo and use the powerful functions and formulas of Excel to enhance IoT data analysis. This feature makes Twinzo more flexible and compatible with your existing data sources and workflows. The airport digital twin provides airport managers with real time data from connected fueling operations, bowsers and fuel farms allowing them to monitor fuel levels and usage patterns. 
This information can be accessed through the Digital Twins line chart with data, which provides insights into fuel consumption and helps managers make more informed decisions about fuel procurement and distribution. Landside operations play a key part in the management of an airport. Integrating concessions, vendors, smart parking feeds, check-in desks, smart bathrooms and security lane activity. This live data helps airport managers forecast passenger activity and to strategically deploy resources to deal with unexpected or high traffic activity. Similar benefits and efficiencies can also be delivered in the airside environment to optimize aircraft parking and reduce congestion on the ramp. By using the different connected data feeds from the digital twin, managers can deliver collaborative and strategic decisions using real-time intelligence to proactively respond, rather than reviewing data that is hours, days, or older. Using the real-time data feeds from the many different data points, all in one platform enables safer and more efficient decisions. Digitizing the operation and reducing costly delays in ground operations. The digital twin features a lighting night mode in Twinzo, which provides real-time visibility into lighting conditions on the airfield. This helps air traffic control, technical services, and AGL teams to monitor and adjust lighting levels as needed, ensuring safe and efficient operations during nighttime and low visibility conditions. Through the innovative Digital Twin platform, users are able to switch views of the highly detailed and comprehensive 3D building layouts, viewing services, utilities, and other hidden infrastructure, by adding layers of detailed information, all of which can also be connected or used as a critical services or network mapping. From here, users can closely monitor and analyze important areas of the building or estate, from baggage systems, check-in, concessions, security, grass, and wildlife habitats. Even IT infrastructure and utilities, which can all lead to increased productivity and safer streamlined operations. Our technology also allows for the monitoring of people movement throughout the building, providing valuable insights into commercial and operational intelligence previously unavailable or not able to be evidenced easily. Organizations connecting and analyzing this data can identify inefficiencies and make data-driven decisions to optimize their operations and ultimately improve overall efficiency <coughs> and revenue opportunities. Our system empowers airport managers and operators with a level of insight that was previously unattainable, allowing them to make more informed decisions, improve safety and operational efficiency, and ultimately enhance the passenger experience. In conclusion, the digital twin solution for airports and aviation provides a range of connected functionality and insight to support a revolution in airport operations. From fueling and ground handling to airside and landside operations. By leveraging real-time data and insights, managers and teams can make more informed and collaborative decisions and optimize airport operations for maximum efficiency and safety. So it goes without saying that the complexity of a use case such as an airport, um, a highly controlled regulatory environment, uh, versatility in terms of its infrastructure with spatial data benefits that are uh, ex extremely valuable um, as a city sized operation. Uh, and it, it's able to connect all these very wide data sets. So real time information live and direct from verified sources reduces that human error, that human interface and reduction in time delays, increases efficiency in terms of communication and visibility across disciplines. The complete digital footprint means you're always on connectivity with artificial intelligence integrations, allowing detailed KPIs from monitoring, reporting and alerting. Um, and it's accessible and intuitive. It's based around uh, very little training, so you can intuitively use it like you would your handheld devices. And that all leads to the better decision making with integrated cross platform data in one space. Easy to use, easy to access and very familiar. Thank you for your time. Andy, question for yourself, please, is what sort of tracking solutions are needed to track the vehicles around the site? Does it need RFID, 3G, 4G, etc? Yeah, a great question, Mike. Um, this, this really relates to the kind of sensor flexibility that you have within your infrastructure. So um, you can use existing infrastructure that you have within your operation. These could be, uh, in the case uh, RFID, they could be Bluetooth, they could be um, uh, six low pan, you name it. So any infrastructure really that's available within your infrastructure can be integrated um, uh, to create that live real time tracking. Very good. And the linked question here is, 
What is your approach to supporting the customer in identifying and exposing the data needed to support these rich digital twins? Yeah, um, in terms of identifying the data points, um, we spend a long time working directly with customers to make sure that they maximize the infrastructure that's available to them. Um, the, the beauty of the platform is its scalability. Uh, you can add as many data sources or as data points as you want. Uh, everything down to something as simple as an Excel spreadsheet to bring interface data in. Uh, so the aim really is to, to work very closely to find what the benefit is, what the problem statement is in order to solve that directly. The question here before I go back to yourself, Amit, after is who are the typical users of this platform? Um, typical users to date have been primarily manufacturing and automotive industries. Um, they've seen significant benefits in terms of efficiencies and savings um, with returns on investment of over 7 million euros in the first 18 months. So um, in terms of efficiency, it's been absolutely incredible. Uh, but they, they, they are now moving into industries quite naturally, as you can imagine, into things like hospitals, um, uh, into rail networks, uh, into airports. So this it's incredibly diverse. And the final question to you both, I'll come to Amit you first and then to yourself, Andy, is how do you handle data sharing between parties and partners in your digital twins? Um, it's it's a very good question. Again, um, from our perspective, for uh, the the main users and the main use cases for our uh, our uh, solution tend to be uh, also the data owner. Um, the the difference here is that when we look at broader aspects and we share it in a wider context, it is about the legal framework and ensuring that suitable sharing agreements are in place prior to that. Uh, so deployment really is 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 in this case uh, used uh, in-house by the data owner. So it's less of a challenge. 